All right, check out this time lapse. This is my husband. He's at the 2023 National Restaurant Association show. It's in Chicago. I asked him to go around to find the Kraft Heinz booth. That is a big bottle of ketchup, ladies and gents. All right, at the trade show, the company is debuting this. It is a customizable digital sauce dispenser. You pick different combinations and the machine then kind of like spits it out and at the end, it kind of shakes it all up to make sure that everything is mixed just the right way. All right, so get this. The self-serve machine lets you choose a base. So you've got ketchup, You've got ranch, 57 sauce, or barbecue sauce. Then you can enhance that sauce with either jalapeno, smoky chipotle, buffalo, or mango. And yes, you can do an intensity level like low, medium, and high as well. So Heinz says, dipping will never be the same, my friends. I, I, I that feel like delicious. it's like one of those uh, soda machines now that you Yeah, yeah that's where my mind went too. Yeah. And so, they had to have looked at that and been like, well, how do we do that, right? Uh -huh. I and would go to a restaurant because of that because yeah. I love sauces. Yeah, the one that caught my eye was the ranch and the smoky chipotle because yes. I feel like ranch is like a base for a lot of different ranch, all of good things. Uh -huh. Yes. And so, but then I think to myself, this also cuts down on all of the packaging. Yeah. Yes. Right? Because you're not going to have packages that get thrown away or whatever. You're going to mm -hmm. make it, you're going to use it right there. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it will all you also tell you the calorie count for each. <laughs> I think they have to, don't yeah. they? Um, <laughs> yeah. I don't I mean, know. It may not be on that prototype, but I'll bet you you have to show I that. I just want to cover my eyes, push the button. <laughs> That's right. And be like, 200, oh my gosh. 200. Right, and all of it. Um, and they call it the Remix, okay. the Heinz Remix. And they're um, piloting it at the show as we speak right now. Um, and you should see it in some restaurants, and I don't know which ones yet. Um, in late this year and early next year. I think it would be great. Love I think it. some people would just want to try something new, just mix it up and see mm -hmm. what they get. Even dipping fries in that, like mm -hmm. a oh, yeah. kind of ranch buffalo or ranch jalapeno. Because the worst that happens is you just don't like it, right? Yeah, and you right. just don't use that small little thing of the stuff. Right. Uh huh. And I dip some of my sauces, I mix them anyways, like if I don't have honey mustard or something like that, if you mix ketchup and mayo together for your french fries, it's mm -hmm. actually quite good. Oh yeah, I mean, I like all of the things mixed do together, don't right. you? Yeah. I like hot sauce and I like ranch together, like yep. buffalo yeah. sauce and ranch together. Mm. So if you're gonna eat wings, I'm like, you have to have both of them and you have to dip the french fry or yeah, whatever true. in both of them. I agree. See, and now eventually <coughs> they're gonna have like where you can do like a, a mix and match of seasonings for the french fries, Ooh. right? Like you just like put, no, I actually put, like, like that idea. Yes. And all that other seasoning, kind of stuff. garlic, yeah, like Pour it in a bag truffle. and shake the fries in it. Ooh, I like awesome. that idea. Who knows where this could end, <laughs> <Yeah>. right? <laughs> Who knows where this could end? And as always, um, we um, are talking about food on the Fortified. Oh, yeah. All right, so fun fact, when did Heinz debut their ketchup? Heinz Gosh. sounds like an old school name. 1795. So I'm say <laughs> yeah, right. 1845. Was that the first You're congressional very close. Congress. 1876. <gasps> Whoa. So before the invention of the light bulb, think about that, before the Eiffel Tower was oh constructed, there was Heinz ketchup. 